All right then guys, um, I know you guys have been wondering after those two days of fights at my school, it was pretty fucking gone through the roof situation, people pulling fire alarms and shit, but now here I'm on the weekend now, I'm just doing a little bit of work on the Astro, got around of changing the differential fluid, which that stuff is like thick and if you look closely, Lots of metal shaves on that plug, and that fluid is not all that well. So we're going to top this off with new stuff, and surprisingly that <coughs> the front differential over there doesn't have that, it was low on fluid the whole entire time we owned this truck. So it's a good thing we're doing this right now besides having differential failure. So, we're just letting it to seep, drain, put the new, good, new stuff in. Kind of got around of just doing details. The inside's always the same as usual. Just, I just vacuumed it. The front's kind of blocked off, I can't get to it. But, we finally fixed this in dump. You, you motherfucker, you piece of shit, go fuck yourself in the ass. But, yeah, um, I remember how such a big piece of shit that this end dump was when we first bought this thing last year. This is a 1966 Bemco end dump trailer from the 60s. Real serious vintage. Um... We do, we do need to do some welds on it, as you can see. It's starting to crack. It kind of cracked more after us putting this thing through daily use. But uh, we finally replaced the two tires on this side because three of them kind of went out. Those two back there are brand new. These two we had laying around. They Luckily, they're still holding up pretty fine, even they're cracked. But these are the original tires that came with the trailer, which we hadn't replaced yet. But those ones still have plenty of tread. This one's kind of bald, pretty much. Oh, you guys can't really see this as well, but the back here is starting to show the bare metal again. That's how much of use we're putting this thing through. Oh yeah, I don't know if I got this in the other videos, uh, the new control system we put in this thing. For the PTO and end dump, I don't know if I got that in my other videos, probably not. But just to be sure, we finally got ourselves a new pump and a PTO because the other, the uh, pump that we put on the last put on this truck actually went out. So it wasn't putting out enough pressure to pick up the end dump. So it's, let me just get under and I'll show you guys. Well, it's new, my valves are starting to leak for the fuel tank, but if you look under here, that's our new PTO. Hold on, let me get a, let me get you guys a better view of this. Right up there. New PTO, new pump, new filter as well, new airlines, and a new pipe that runs through the platform. But yeah, we're draining the differential. Luckily, we are, we are actually changing this because if we kept driving this truck, this one right here could have failed because this thing was low on fluid because it's actually leaking a bit. The rear one um, was kind of topped off, but the front here was empty, kind of. But yeah, we're kind of servicing this truck. I need to do an oil change on it soon. But everything else is doing good on this truck. People keep asking me about this Astro. Like, hey, JR, uh, do you still have it, or have you sold it, or anything like that? No, we still do have it. We're never going to sell this thing, to let you guys know. We're just going to keep this thing until generations, generations come by. But, uh, yeah, I, I have nothing to do right now besides just drain the fluids out of this thing. It's already 100, almost 100 degrees here in California. 
it's pretty hot out but I just want to get you guys an update what's been going on with these two professional kind of appliances heavy equipment appliances this end dump is pretty much resurrected and this thing's been resurrected but it's doing pretty good I still need to clean the windows give it a wax again front end's still looking pretty good but yeah and the other thing is we actually changed this tire right here because the other one was starting to bald finally replaced that mirror uh, the chrome stack up there is starting to blew out for some reason I guess it doesn't take up to the heat resistance but uh, yeah hope you guys like this video give it a thumbs up subscribe see you guys in the next video one more thing before ending this video um, I think that from people watching my YouTube videos I think they recognize this truck here in California and I think uh, my dad said that when he was driving this truck the other day that some fan went up to us and like said that like I should call this in dump the Mad Max and I should spray paint something like that on the side there who knows but yeah this thing is really cranking up the subscribers on my channel this GM classic but yeah <laughs> a lot more to come see you guys